squirrels all over the place. So what are we doing out here on this beautiful, beautiful fall day? Well, we're out here just taking it easy, trying to see if we can see any leaves changing colors. They started falling a couple weeks ago off the weaker trees and as you can see they are definitely starting to turn some colors another week or so and they will be beautiful but I have a question and of course I have an answer for it as well as far as I'm concerned how cold is too cold to ride now, I've seen a lot of people asking about it and a lot of people wondering with it coming up winter time winter's coming quick when is it time to put the bike away when is it too cold to ride well for most people it is too cold to ride when that cold winter air starts touching that skin and it just becomes miserable to actually ride now, some people will put on thermals and winter gear and they will ride right on through that. So, is that too cold to ride? All depends. To be honest with it, with you, too cold to ride is all dependent on the rider and the machine they're riding. Now, a couple of things you need to ask yourself before you start riding in cold weather is do you really want to ride in that cold of weather? Now, it's a lot more stressful on the body, a lot more fatigue sets in. And if you do get cold, your concentration is nowhere near what it normally is on a nice warm day like today. So you have to take that into account. You also need to take your bike into account. Now if you're like me, or most people that ride, you've been riding on those tires all summer. And you hadn't necessarily taken it too easy on those tires. You've given it just as hard as it's given back. So you need to look at those tires and ask yourself, well, are they good enough to make it this winter? in the cold weather now tires are real important because of course the road's going to be colder the air is going to be colder and those tires aren't going to be as sticky it's going to take longer for them to warm up and get that sticky so hence the way you ride is going to play a part in it normally you go out and you take these turns 50 60 miles an hour right out your driveway you might want to slow it better down a little bit so now how cold is it too cold to ride for me it's too cold to ride when it's just taking too long for those tires to warm up When you can't really enjoy your ride because your tires are still sliding and they're not getting sticky and whatever you do you can't warm them up for me personally that's when it's too cold to ride when it becomes a safety factor now around here that's usually around october november sometime of course i live at the bottom of the mountains in north carolina that's going to change for people that live up in minnesota But what it does is it actually gives you a time once that you realize it is too cold to ride it gives you a time to check your bike over real good now a lot of us we just jump on our bikes and we go we enjoy riding 
and we enjoy cleaning our machines and everything like that but we don't really look over it maintenance wise and when it gets that too cold to ride that gives you a real good chance to check it over gives you a stretch of a couple of months you check your tire check your chain your sprockets throttle cables hoses stuff like that and then my suggestion when you put your bike up for the winter try and pick get it up off the ground don't leave it sitting on the wet ground even if you're putting tarp over it roll it up on some boards or something and that'll help your dry rod and your tires over the winter time when you jump on them next summer they won't have a soft spot in it luckily for me it has not gotten too cold to ride yet so hopefully i can bring a couple more videos in before it does and hopefully we can enjoy these beautiful leaves so until next time go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed it oh a little bit slide go ahead and hit that thumbs up Keep it shiny side up.